Hi, boys and girls. I'm so excited to have you here with me again. And how are you? Do you want to give me a thumbs up or a thumbs down? Let me know how you are. Oh, I see those thumbs. Yes, yes. Uh, but not to worry, no matter what, I hope you still remember something which I, which I would love to share with you. Are you listening? Yes. You are special. Mm -hmm. And I'm equally ex excited to have our special friends with us. Should we meet them? Yeah. Hi, Steve. Hello, Steve. Hello, Karen. And hello, boys and girls. Hello, everybody. How are you? I'm very well. How are you still? I'm fine, thank you. Yeah, good, both well. Good, good. And are you ready for our story time today? Mm -hmm. Love story time. So, Please yeah, we're ready. Yes, good. And boys and girls, are you sitting comfortably? Mm -hmm. Now again, I see some standing, some are sitting, and some are all snuggled in bed. Yes, but whatever the position, I hope you are comfortable. So let's begin our story, just in case you ever wonder, by Max Lucado and illustrated by Tony Goff. Long, long time ago, God made a decision, a very important decision. He made the decision to make you. The same hands that made the stars made you. The same hands that made the mountains made you. The same hands that made the trees and the moon and the sun made you. That's why you are so special. God made you. He made you in a very special way. He made your eyes so that you could twinkle. He made your mouth so you could smile. He made you laugh ha <laughs> ha so you could giggle. God made you like no one else. If you looked all over the world, in every house, there would be no one else like you. No one with your eyes, no one with your mouth, no one with your laugh. You are very, very special. <laughs> You're bigger now. You can do more things. You can walk. And run, you can play and talk, you can eat and sing and look at books. You even go to big school. You're not a little baby anymore. But as you grow and change, some things will stay the same. God will always love you, God will always hug you, God will always be on your side. And I want you to know that, just in case you ever wonder. When you see monsters in the shadows, talk to God. On hard days when kids are mean and don't treat you like they should, talk to God. If your grades are bad and your teacher is mad, talk to God, because he loves you. And we always will, just in case you ever wonder. Most of all, you'll learn about God. He loves you. He protects you. He and his angels always watch over you. And God wants me to make sure you know about heaven. It's a wonderful place. There are no tears there, no monsters, 
and no mean people. You never have to say goodbye or good night or I'm hungry. You never get cold or sick or afraid. In heaven, you are so close to God that he will hug you just like I hug you too. It's going to be wonderful. I will be there too. I promise. We will be there together forever. Remember that. Just in case you ever wonder. The end. Oh, how did you enjoy that story? Stilton, how did you enjoy the story? I love stories. That was really good. It was good. And do you remember the story from last week when we learned about being made just as the maker intended? I like that. Yes. And did you notice the words in this story that kept coming round that just in case you ever wondered? Do you ever wonder about things? Sometimes. Do you wonder about different things now from when you were smaller because the story was about a baby growing up? So now you're bigger, do you wonder about different things? I do. And what's the right thing to do when you wonder about something? Uh, come and ask you. You come and ask me. Now, not all the boys and girls can come and ask me. So you come and ask me. I do. Do you know everything? Do I know everything? No, I don't know everything. But if, it's, if you ask me something I don't know, we'll go and find out about it together. Would that be good? That's exciting. Yeah, I think that would be good because we're all part of the family. Yes, we are. Yes, we are indeed. Now, what sort of things might you wonder about? Oh, I don't know. It varies. It does vary. It's different all the time, isn't it, as we grow up? But you know what? What? Something you needn't ever wonder about. What's that? That I will always love you and I will always be here for you. Wow. I like that. And how does knowing that make you feel? Uh, safe. Safe. That's a good word. If you ever wonder about something and you want to feel safe, ask the right person. I'd like it when you feel safe. Yes. Can we remember that this week? I think we can remember that this week. If you've ever wondered about something, ask the right people and make sure that you feel safe. Safe. That's a good lesson. I like that. Okay. And I like that too. True. And boys and girls, if you ha don't have that special person to ask, you know you can always ask someone who's called God. He'll always be there for you. He'll always hug you. He'll always love you. And like we said, he will never leave you alone. So thank you for coming and have a wonderful week. Stay safe. Bye. <laughs>